Good morning, everyone. It's um, October the 27th, the 301st day. We're studying uh, the Bob Golf book, Live in Grace, Walk in Love. And uh, the topic today is God doesn't enjoy seeing us fail. He loves watching us grow. The verse today is John 15, uh, verse 2. He cuts off every branch in me that bears no fruit, while every branch that does bear fruit, he prunes so that it will be even more fruitful. Jesus taught us many lessons with nature as a metaphor. I figured I should learn more about wheat and seeds and trees and stuff. So when I came up, come across farmers or lumberjacks, I do a little form, informal research to learn what it's all about. In one of these conversations, a lumberjack actually helped me understand the reason behind some of the pain and failure we all go through at some point in our lives. He said for trees to be healthy, they have to be pruned on a regular basis. He climbs up the trees, sometimes with a chainsaw, and cuts off all the diseased branches. He also cuts out dead branches and limbs growing in the wrong direction so that the other branches can grow in a healthy direction. When I heard him describe the process, it made a lot of sense to me. Jesus talked about trees and branches. He even said healthy trees, the ones that bear fruit, need to be pruned sometimes so that they'll bear even more fruit. It makes sense when I think about all the times I've had to cut things out of my life. Sometimes I'm not the one pruning either. Often God will take things away to guide me in a different direction. When he does, I figured out later it was to help me become more of the person he had in mind for me to be. Uh, God doesn't enjoy seeing us go through the pain of loss and failure, but he does love watching us grow. Sometimes we do the cutting and sometimes he does. The end objective is for us to grow into the people God sees us turning into. So who is God turning you into? And that's your thought for the day. Um, let us pray. Heavenly Father, on this beautiful fall day, bless us with awareness for people who need acceptance and grace in your love. Help us to be your vehicle to that grace. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen.